Pero kumusta ang buhay sa Australia? Sa Perth, Australia? Kuya. O, oh, kuya na ngayon. <laughs> kuya. Um, nasanay na rin kasi akong mag-isa. You live alone in Australia? Yes, I live alone. Okay. Ngayon, siguro sa iba, isipin nila malungkot. Gagaw mo ng paraan eh. Maupo ka na lang ba, tatanggapin mo na malungkot? Hindi, ang dami kong mga kaibigan doon. Yung mga anak ko naman, nagpupunta rin at saka lumaki naman sila kasama ko doon. I think lungkot, it's all just a state of mind. Mm-hmm. Uh, busy yourself, do something, improve yourself. Para walang lungkot. Uh, you do yoga? Oh, yes. Yoga's... Ano yan? Constant? Is that every day? Um, pa- no, naman every day kasi kailangan ko rin tanggapin na medyo pagka heavy yung ginawa ko today, bukas medyo me sakit dito, sakit doon. Oh. I, I give my body enough time to recuperate. Give me the basics. The basic? Okay. Yeah. If we just made a forward fold, Okay. Just bend forward. Uh, uh, anong from, tawag dito? From your, just a forward fold. Fold? Yes. Okay, forward fold. Just from fold. your hips. Make okay. sure it's, it's not the top, but it's from your hips. Okay. And you try to go as slow as you can. Okay. Until you're comfortable. Until you're comfortable. Uh-huh. Until you're comfortable. Okay. okay. And okay. until you're comfortable. At gaano katagal kang namamalagi? <laughs> Hanggang dito lang ako. Do not strain yourself. I know, I know, If it's I up know. to there, Okay. And then that's okay. it. Every day, as long as you practice the same thing, it's just like life. I was gonna say, boy, um, the misconception of yoga, hindi ito puro bending or touch your toes or you can put your foot up your nose or something. So yun ang nakikita, no, 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 diba? no. Yoga is breathing. Yoga is meditation. Yoga is relaxation. Pero ang hindi mo napapansin, you're stretching, which is good for the body. Tama. It's relaxing, it's good for your mind, it's good for your soul. Yeah. I'm learning a lot. Please, okay. Oh, nice, <laughs> Thank diba? you. Oh, naku, yoga has taught me so much, especially how to just keep quiet. <laughs> and be still. Yes, be still, but then you hear everything. Lalo na ngayon, talagang you hear everything pag ang pinag-uusapan ay ang iyong apo. Hala, naku, may putsyola! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Ay, ano bang ibig sabihin ng putsyola? I would... Uh, no, it's just it's a term of endearment. endearment. Yes, yes. Okay. Instead of saying my little darling or my baby girl, is my putsyola. Paano ka... Bi- <laughs> Ayan, and there, there she is. Hailey! So, Hailey kumusta? Po. Kumusta? Paano binago ang iyong buhay <clears throat> uh, ng iyong apo? Glamma. 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 Yes. yes. Um, I don't know. Uh, I thought when I had my children, yun na yung highlight ng yung mom in me. Iba yung high ng lola. Hindi ko pwedeng masabing it's more than when I had my kids. Hindi. I think it's part of womanhood. Naakala mo you graduate pag mom ka na. Hindi may continuation pa pala pagka naging lola ka. Mm-mm. Meron pa rin. Ibang stage na naman ng womanhood. How were you as a mother? I was mother, to father... To Joseph and to Diego. Yes, I was everything to them. Mother, father, brother, sister, everything to them. Kasi wala eh. Diba? I had to work, but I had to be at home too. I had to put food on the table, but I had to take them to, to footy. I had to work and fly, but I have to come back because my son needs me for this. I really tried so hard to be everything, to mm-hmm. be everything. But you know what? It still isn't enough. It will never be enough. Because you cannot be everything. Nagkaroon ho tayo ng pagkakataon, makakwentuhan dito si Diego. And uh, he had some revelations. But uh, after a long time, he was in a good place. I'm talking to you now as a friend. He was in a good place and I was happy. Off and on cam. And of course, he was so excited about a baby, etc. Tong, maraming nangyari sa buhay ng anak mo. He talked about his uh, life sa loob ng rehab. He got into drugs. Sinisi mo ba ang sarili mo? Oh, oh. Kasi nga, I wasn't always there. Even if I tried to always be there, I just couldn't. Somebody had to work. Somebody had to put food on the table. Somebody Kainan had to put a roof over their heads. Somebody had to put them to school. And please, I'm not saying this na I'm degrading other people. No. Wala akong inaapuntiriyang mga wala doon. Yun ang sitwasyon namin, so I dealt with it the best way I could. 